The British Astronomical Association BAA was formed in 1890 as a national body to support the UK's amateur astronomers. Throughout its history, the BAA has encouraged observers to make scientifically valuable observations, often in collaboration with professional colleagues. Among the BAA's first presidents was Walter Maunder, discoverer of the 17th-century dearth in sunspots now known as the Maunder Minimum which he achieved by analyzing historical observations. Later, this spirit of observing the night sky scientifically was championed by George Alcock, who discovered five comets and five novae using nothing more than a pair of binoculars. The BAA continues to contribute to the science of astronomy, even despite modern competition from space-based telescopes and highly automated professional observatories. Modern digital sensors, coupled with techniques such as lucky imaging, mean that even modest amateur equipment can rival what professional observatories could have achieved a few decades ago. The vastness of the night sky, together with the sheer number of amateur observatories, mean that BAA members are often the first to pick up new phenomena. In recent years, the association's leading supernova hunter, Tom Bowles, president 2003-5, has discovered over 150 supernovae. He now holds the world record for the greatest number of such events discovered by any individual in history. More recently, the BAA has worked increasingly with international partners. Modern communications allow astronomers in different time zones around the world to hand over the monitoring of variable stars and planetary weather systems to colleagues on other continents as the sun comes up, resulting in a 24-hour watch on the sky. For example, the association's Variable Star Section works closely with the American Association of Variable Star Observers, meanwhile its Jupiter Section works with a global network of planetary observers through the JUPOS collaboration. <laughs> Publications The association's longest standing publication is its journal, published six times a year and sent to all members. Once a year, the association also publishes a handbook which comprises an almanac for the following year. Electronic bulletins are issued to give more immediate notice by email of discoveries, astronomical news and BAA meetings. Topic. Structure The association operates a wide range of observing sections which specialize in particular branches of astronomy, welcoming observers and astronomy enthusiasts of all abilities in a spirit of collaboration and mutual help. It also founded and supports the Campaign for Dark Skies, a UK-wide campaign against excessive light pollution. The BAA leases office space from the Royal Astronomical Society, in Burlington House, Piccadilly, London. Many of its meetings are also held there. History. In October 1890, the BAA was formed to support amateur astronomers in the UK. In many ways it is a counterpart to the Royal Astronomical Society, which primarily supports professional observers, and the two organisations have long shared the same premises. The idea for this organization was first publicly proposed by Irish astronomer William H. S. Monk in a letter published in The English Mechanic on July 12. Playing a significant role in the founding of the association was English astronomer E. Walter Maunder, with the help of his brother Frid Maunder and William H. Ma. 
The first meeting of the association was held on 1890 October 24, with 60 of the initial 283 members in attendance. Initially it was decided to run the association with a provisional 48-member council that included four women, Margaret Huggins, Elizabeth Brown, Agnes Clerk and Agnes Gyburn. The society formed several observing sections for specialized topics in astronomy. Elizabeth Brown, possibly the only woman in England at the time to own her own observatory, became head of the solar section. The association was presented with or bequeathed various astronomical instruments, but lacked the funds to build their own observatory. A total of 477 instruments were acquired during the first 117 years since the association was founded. Topic branches The association held monthly meetings in London, but also established branches to cater for members who could not attend London activities and desired to meet in their own areas. The first of these was the Northwestern branch which served members in the northwest of England, centred on Manchester. The branch was formed in 1892. In 1903, it ceded from the BAA to form the Manchester Astronomical Society. North Western Branch Presidents S. O. Kell, 1892 to 1895, Professor. T. H. Core 1895 to 1903. In 1891, a group of amateurs in Australia began discussing the idea of setting up branches of the BAA in their own country. What would become the New South Wales branch was established in 1895 and would be the only one to survive for more than a brief period. This branch became the second oldest astronomy organisation in Australia and is still in existence. New South Wales branch presidents John Tebbett 1894 to 1896, George Handley Nibbs 1896 to 1898, Rev. Thomas Roseby 1898 to 1900, Walter Frederick Gale 1900 to 1902, William John Macdonald 1902 to 1904, George Denton Hurst 1904 to 1906, Charles J Murfield 1906 1907, Hugh Wright 1907 to 1909, James Nangle 1909 to 1911, Rev. Thomas Roseby 1911–1914 Walter Frederick Gale 1914–1923 Rev. Edward F. Piggott 1923–1925 J. J. Richardson 1925–1927 Walter Frederick Gale 1927–1929 James Nangle 1929–1930 Walter Frederick Gale 1930–1932 and 1932–1933 Rev. William O'Leary 1933–1934 and 1934–1935 Walter Frederick Gale 1935–1936 Alan Patrick McCarris 1936–1937 Walter Frederick Gale 1937–1938 and 1938–1939 Henry Herbert Baker 1939–1940 Harley Weston Wood 19 1940–1942 Walter Frederick Gale 1942–1943 Alan Patrick McCarris 1943–1945 Horace Edgar Frank Pinnock 1945–1946 Alan Patrick McCarris 1946–1947 W. H. Robertson 1947–1950 D. Coleman Trainer 1950–1951 Alan Patrick McCarris 1951–1954 Harley Weston Wood 1954–1956 Rev. 
Thomas Noel Berg Gaffney 1956 to 1958 W Kemp Robertson 1958 to 1960 F J Bannister 1960 to 1962 Alan Patrick McCarris 1962 to 1964 W H Robertson 1964 to 1966 Noel James Halsey Bissaker 1966 to 1968 W Swanson 1968 to 1971 W E Moser 1971 to 1974 K Sims 1974 to 1976 R Giller 1976 to 1978 T L Morgan 1978 1979 F N Trainer 1979 to 1981 S J Elwin 1981 1982 F N Trainer 1980 to 1984 J Jackson 1984 to 1986 Colin Bembrick 1986 to 1988 D Allen Yates 1988 1990 1990 2000 unknown 2000 2001 Dr Wayne Orkeston 2001 date unknown a West of Scotland branch was established by an inaugural meeting held on the 23rd of November 18 94, to be based in Glasgow. In 1905 authority was granted to enrol members from the whole of Scotland, but it was not until 1937 that the name was changed to «Scottish Branch». In 1954 the branch ceded from the BAA to form the Astronomical Society of Glasgow. West of Scotland branch presidents Walter C. Burgius 1895–1897 John Danskin 1897–1899 Rev. Edward Bruce Kirk 1899–1901 John Danskin 1901–1903 Robert Robertson 1903 1905 James Waddell 1905 to 1907 Major John Castles 1907 to 1909 Archibald Campbell 1909 to 1911 Dr Alexander D Ross 1911 to 1913 Archibald A Young 1913 to 1915 John Johnston Ross 1915 to 1917 Frank C Thompson 1917 to 1919 Henry McEwen 1919 to 1921 John O Ross 1921 to 1923 John D McDougall 1923 to 1925 Charles Cochran 1925 to 1927 Charles Cleland 1927 to 1929 Thomas L MacDonald 1929 to 1931 David Buchanan Duncanson 1931 to 1933 William B Inverarity 1933 to 1935 George Douglas Buchanan 1935 to 1937 Professor William Marshall Smart 1937-1938 Scottish branch presidents Professor William Marshall Smart 1938-1939 Professor William Michael Herbert Greaves 1939 to 1941 Charles T. McIvan 1941 to 1943 Professor William Marshall Smart 1943 to 1945 Rev J Graham 1945 to 1947 W H Marshall 1947 to 1949 C. Walmsley 1951–1953 Dr. T. R. Tannehill 1953–1954 In 1896 an East of Scotland branch was formed. 
This branch was dissolved due to lack of support on 3 October 1902. East of Scotland branch presidents William Peck 1896–1898 William Firth 1898–1900 John Turner 1900 to 1902 in 1897 a second Australian branch was formed by 13 members living in Victoria At the London AGM of 1907 the president noted that the Victoria branch appears to be in a moribund condition Victoria branch presidents Robert Ellery 1897 to 1900 Rev. John Meeklejohn 1900–1901 Ernest Frederick John Love 1901–1904 Professor. William Charles Kernett 1904–1905 Robert James Allman Barnard 1905 The Victoria Branch was re-established in 1951 as the Victorian Branch, but only lasted until 1963. Victorian Branch Presidents Philip Crosby Morrison 1951–1952 George Anderson 1953–1957 H. B. Lewis 1958–1959 Dr. G. F. Walker 1959–1960 C. S. Middleton 1960–1961 George Anderson 1961–1962 in 1901 at a meeting of the Birmingham Natural History and Philosophical Society it was proposed to form a Midland branch of the BAA, support proved to be less than had been envisioned and there are no reports of any activity after 1903. Midland branch presidents Sir Oliver Lodge 1901–1902 G. M. Seabrook 1902–1903 What would become the BAA Western Australia branch started as the Western Australian Astronomical Society in 1912. When difficulties were encountered in the mid-1920s Professor. Ross highlighted the advantages of restarting within the BAA. The inaugural meeting was held on 29 March 1927. However support was still lacking and there is no recorded activity after September 1929. Western Australia Branch President Professor. Alexander David Ross 1927 Presidents See also List of astronomical societies <laughs>